up y'all it's your girl sugar box and i'm back with another video how y'all doing today i'm doing okay and yeah so in case you notice i hadn't posted in like all week and that's because i've been busy and to be completely honest i was a little down about the whole instagram account getting hacked situation and i'm still a little upset about it but whatever life goes on right and um i keep saying and you can count the many times i say and anyway um but i've been trying to get my following back up and it it's quite the task but whatever i mean I, I know I'll get them back up. It's just going to take some time, you know. Um, but, <clears throat> as you can see, today's video is a clothing haul. And, uh, yeah. So, um, I got two items from Rue21. And I got some stuff from Target today. Um, I also have some non-clothing related items. It's like two things that I'm going to show you in today's video that I got. And, yeah, okay, I'm done saying and, but, yeah. Um, but if you're new here, welcome, welcome. Become an official sugar bear by hitting the subscribe button. Hit the notification bell as well so you know when I post a video. And why would you want to do that? Because it's beautiful over here. No negativity. Okay. Ah, I did that shit. <laughs> um, just to let you know, too, if... There are going to be kids watching this. I'm going to leave a disclaimer at the bottom saying viewer discretion advised because one of the clothing, clothing, mm, do, 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 do. what's happening? I'm talking too fast. That's what's happening. Anyway, um, one of the clothing items actually has a cuss word on it. So yeah, I will leave that disclaimer in the description box. Viewer discretion is advised. Let me know right now as well. So yeah. Let's get on to it. As always, I always um, let you guys know uh, original price points, sales prices, if I didn't get it on sale. And I will put the um, link to the website in the description box, as well as the links to the items I show in this video. Sometimes it's hard to find them, though, especially if it's like a get it before it's almost gone type of deal. So, yeah. I will try, though. I do. I do genuinely try. Alright, so these items, the first two items I'm about to show you are um, from Rue21. Um, and I actually ordered these online. I didn't get them in store. The thing I like about how they set up their receipts is they actually tell you price the um, original price, original price, and then the clearance price. Um, some online receipts don't do that. Some in-store receipts don't do that. So... Yeah, alright, so let's get on to it. I, I feel like I keep pausing. I'm like, for real, for real, I do keep pausing. I do. I do. <laughs> alright, so here's the first item, and this is the clothing item I was telling you about that has the cuss word on it. it says, bitch, bye. Now, I did actually see um, the black one in the store, but I didn't get it. And I seen this online, and I was like, you know what, why not? It's cute, and it was on sale. Um, I believe Rue 21 had a, um, it was online and in-store sale. I think it was like 40% off. Alright, so here. The original price point for this was $39.99, wait, wrong item. Um, $16.99, and I got it for $6.80. And by the way, um, just to highlight one thing. Somebody in my, um, comment section on the, last, on the um, last Instagram, the last video I posted about I got hacked, they suggested that I try on the clothes, and I truly do appreciate that, um, suggestion. Um, next time I will. I, the reason why I don't though is because this is a webcam, and it's kind of hard to show you, like, how the clothes fit if I'm on the webcam. I need to get an actual camera, like a Nikon or something, so I can 
hook up the tripod and everything. But yeah. So yeah, that's why I, that that is why I don't try on the clothes. Because I want you to see the trueness of it. I want you to get like a whole view. You know what I'm saying? It's kind of hard to put you to like put it on the webcam. So yeah. But thank you for that suggestion. I forgot what your name was, but thank you so very much. Alright, moving on. And I got this in a size 2X. I can tell you right now, this shirt about to be real big on me. I already know. Because it looked big. I should have got like an extra large or something. Alright, and here is the last item I got from Rue21. Some ash ashes. What is happening? I cannot talk today, like, for the life of me. What is going on? The past few videos, I've just been, like, stuttering and stuff and saying the wrong stuff. So, like, what the heck is going on? Like, my mouth is going a mile a minute. And my brain is just like, error, error. Oh, yeah, and by the way, before we continue on, let's get a clap one time for the makeup. Because you know what? It's been a long time since I wore makeup on here. Usually I'm looking busted. Past few videos, I had no makeup on and I believe one of them, my hair was like, poof. Oh yeah, speaking of hair. <laughs> you like my braids or no? <laughs> I got some purple hair this time. Don't you think it's cute? And it goes with my makeup. So yeah, I wanted to try something different. Um, I actually did a hair review on the, um, not this particular, well, this brand of hair. Because, like, go watch the video. It's called Femme Slash Shake and Go Hair Review. Go check it out. And technically, it's the only hair I use now. Like, I used to use braid bait. Um, and if you follow me on Instagram, you've seen the hair reviews. And by the way, if you don't follow me on Instagram, I will leave that link in the description box so you can come follow me. Because why? Why would you want to do that? Because it's me and you love me. That's why. No. I mean it for, the, for it to come off like that. God forgive me. <laughs> but no. Yeah. Come follow me if you want to on Instagram. Because it's lit. Alright. Back to the clothes. So I got these asset wash jeans. They're very stretchy, and that's what the, I like. Okay, I got them in a size 16. They're called Mid Rise Crop Skinny. I love skinny jeans, like how they hug, like the bottom, the um, how they hug your ankles. It feels so comfortable, man, and they look go really good with like boots in the winter time. So yeah. I love skinny jeans. I love how they look. Alright, so these jeans actually have, like, rips on them. Usually, I don't go to that extent and go that far. I have all my skin all out. I do have ripped jeans, but they don't, they're not, like, to this extent. But I was like, eh, whatever. They cute. They gonna be cute on me, too, so. It's okay. <laughs> Alright, so they're just regular ripped jeans. Acid washed. Got them in a size 16. I already said that. And so, the original price point was $39.99. And guess how much I got these for? Guess. You will never guess. $16, fam. What? That's a hella discount, like, major, major, major key alert. Where's the DJ Khaled? $16 for $40 jeans? Where'd he do that at? Okay. <laughs> I was just hella pumped about that, like, for real. I would never spend $40 on one pair of jeans. But I got these for $16. Alright, so in all, what I spent at Rue 21 was $39.24. So basically $40. And yeah, so that's going to be it for Rue 21. I believe they still have these on their website. Like I said, I'll put the links in the description box. <coughs> Alright. 
So that's, I'm sorry, y'all. For some, like I be saying, this daggone computer be doing some weird shit. For real. For real, for real. Alright, so that's what I got from Rue 21. We're just going to set that on my bed. Put that in my closet and I'm moving it. Alright, so I'm sorry, y'all. I'm all like texting my bra and the camera. But low key, these drunks be trying to pop out. Like, for real. They be trying to roam all over the neighborhood. That's how big they are. Just a nuisance. Okay, enough of that. That was just inappropriate i'm so sorry anyway moving on to target um so i don't know what i did with my receipt i think it's in my purse but we should be good all right so first thing i got from target out oh yeah and i hit up the clearance section again and they had more stuff this time i was like lit life lit life for real, for real, because that clearance section at Target disappointed me the last time, but when I went in there, I guess because I had kept going, like, back to back, but I went in there today, I was, like, on my way somewhere, and I was like, you know what, Target is right down the street. I should low-key go see if they got something on that clearance rack, and they did not disappoint. Oh, okay. girl, let me show you what I got, boo-boo. All right. So I got a pair of Wild Fable jeans. Ah! <laughs> Y'all know I love Wild Fable. Like for real. That is my brand when I go to Target. Wild Fable. This shirt is Wild Fable. Okay. Alright. So I actually got these um, in a size 18. Because I don't know how they're going to fit. And they're not really that stretchy. Um, so... If they're too big, I'll just put a belt on. That's it. That's all I can really do. Um, but they are called High Rise Mom Jeans. I did not read that shit. You know what? That is terrible. <laughs> like, I'm already about to be 30 and I'm wearing mom jeans. But these joints low-key was cute, though. I had to see that shit. I had to get them. Alright, so I got them in a size 18. These, as you can tell, don't have rips in them. They're just a plain pair of jeans, but because of the sales price, that's why I got them. Alright, so these were originally $22, and I got them for $11, player, $11, so it was 50% off, half off. But these is wild fable, y'all. Like, low-key, I would never buy <clears throat> jeans at Target either, because... The jeans at Target be hella expensive. $22 for one pair of pants. Like, that's just idiocracy. There may be some people who think that's okay, but not Shalene. Like, for real, for real, it's like, I'm not penny pinch, like, in a penny pinch state. Because I happen to think I've improved in that department. Because I'll be buying clothes, like, all the time now, like. <clears throat> but I make sure it's like reasonable price. You don't want to go psycho in the store buying a whole bunch of stuff because it's name brand and it looks good and then you pay like a uh, super high price. Like that's just dumb. Celebrities can do that because they got money, right? But not Shaleen. No, I'm not doing that. No, no, no. I will not. Alright, so moving on. So that's just my mom jeans that I didn't know it said mom jeans on it. But whatever. They cute, so. Bada boom. Alright. <clears throat> so moving on to the next item. On to the next. On to the next. <laughs> Alright. So this is. I guess you could say this is like a sweat. Not like a sweatshirt, like a regular, regular shirt. But it's like a crop. Well, no, can't really say it's crop top. Just look at the bottom, though. Like, it's weird. It's weird how they made it. But it's cute, though. And it's Lion King, right? So, <clears throat> the la I think the last time I went to Target, the Lion King stuff was still, like, full price, right? So, I hit up the clearance rack, and I found me some Lion King stuff. Well, 
I think it was only this item when I came that I got. And it says what? Because I can't get the sleeve to open. Akuna Matata. That's what they say on the sleeve. Ain't that cute? So this sleeve says Akuna. Let me see if I open this. This is crazy. The front sleeve says Akuna, and y'all can't get it all in the camera. And the other sleeve says Matata. Akuna Matata. Ain't that cute? And I say Lion King on the sleeve. I actually got this one in a 2X, and I, so I know it's going to be too big for me. I already know. Um, but the original price point for this was, let me see if I can, $19.99 to like $20. And I got it for $9.98, so like 50% off, $10 basically. It's just a plain color. It's like, a, it's really soft. Like, this don't feel real good on my skin when I put it on. And it's like a... Just like a dark border. Mind you of like terry cloth material. Like this joint. Mm, this is gonna feel so silky on my skin. I already know. I might be sleeping in that one day. <laughs> Alright. <clears throat> and this next item I got is another shirt. I actually got this one in a large because I looked at it and I was like, oh, this should fit me. Like, I don't know. I get real like different sizes on account of like I've stated before. It's really really hard to tell what fits me anymore because I'm like my weight is up and down, and so something may look like it's gonna be you know the right size and then turn around and be hella big on me so yeah I mean I can always return it but I don't never return it because it'd be comfortable like who cares what people say all that looks big on me and and it's my body anyway <laughs> so if you're a 90s kid like me you know who Garfield is and I ain't talking about that generic Garfield they try to put on TV these days either. Because the original Garfield was where it's at, yo. That generic stuff they got out now, no, son. No, no, no. No, 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 no. It's all about the original Garfield. Alright? So it says, Life's a Beach. And this is a crop top, actually. Um, so... It looked big, like, big enough for me, so I should be able to fit this just fine. I got this in a size large, I already said that. So this shirt was originally $14, and I got it for $7.50. Wait. Wait, what? Wait, what? Wait, what? Wait, Originally $14.99, but yeah, it's still like 50% 50, 50 off. So wait a minute. Let me look at something real quick, because I'm low-key. Okay, never mind. Never mind. Alright. <clears throat> so, yeah, it's just a little crop top situation. Y'all know I like the crop tops. Alright, and, <clears throat> oh, so I actually have three items that aren't clothing related. Um, one of them I got from Dollar General. So it's like three different stores and one clothing haul. Ain't y'all lucky. Ain't y'all lucky. Alright, um, so this first item is <laughs> Wild Fable earrings. These were only six bucks. Uh-oh. I like how they look for real, like, they real lightweight or whatever, and it's like, who wants to wear heavy earrings and have your earlobes all down like that? Like, that's not cool, like, I wear hoops on rare, like, on occasion, rare occasions, but, like, low-key, I just be wearing my stud earrings, like, how I got on. You like them? It's lips. Wanna keep? 
anyway, so, yeah, just playing earrings. Alright, and these are just some hair scrunchies. I picked these up because I like the colors. Y'all know I like bright colors. Like, I got black down there. But all of these up here, this whole color spectrum, I was like, living for it. Gotta have it. They're so cute. Those were originally... Originally. I think these were like... These were like $5. So, yeah. I don't have my receipt in front of me. It's in my purse. Anyway, so... On to the last item. This is the item I got from Dollar General. Um, not clothing related, but, you know, I got it at Dollar General. Oh, and by the way, y'all, Dollar General got their little gift sets out now for Christmas, so. If you looking for a cheap place to go Christmas shopping, Dollar General, they got their stuff out, like, I got it out. Alright, so this is O'Keefe's. So, basically, um... I don't know if you ever seen the commercials for it, um, but, like, when O'Keefe's first start coming out, it was O'Keefe's hard work and hands, right? Now, if you work retail, like I used to, um, <clears throat> if you, excuse me, if you work retail like I used to, then you notice how hard and dry and not, like, flaky or whatever, but if you notice how dry your hands be, right? Because you, like, constantly putting on hand sanitizer. Well, I don't know about anybody else. I know I did. I used to tear up some hand sanitizer. And when I worked at the casino, too, because you don't know when people put their hands on it. They could have dug up their nose before they handed you whatever they just handed you. You feel me? I'm very, very, not germaphobic, but very cautious when I touch people. You feel me? And after I touch your hand, hand sanitizer. I don't care if you get offended. Because, like I said, you don't know what people be doing with their hands. You got to think about that. So anyway, back to my original point. I used to tear up some hand sanitizer. Um, and I always said I wanted to get the O'Keefe's hard working hands, right? So, I got that. The hand cream. And I got... The, um, foot cream, too. O'Keefe's Healthy for, um, O'Keefe's for Healthy Feet. And then I got the lip balm. I didn't even know they had lip balm, but O'Keefe's is coming up in the world. And I'm here for it. So, what I can do, since I bought this item, I can, um, do a review on it and let you guys know if it's worth the money. This gift set was only 10 bucks for all three of these items. You cannot beat that. At all. You cannot. You cannot beat that. So, that's why I picked it up. Because, like I said, I always wanted to try the old Keeps Hard Work at Hand. And then, I seen the foot cream and I was like, um. Not embarrassing fact or whatever, but for some reason, sometimes my feet are, like, extremely dry. I have extremely dry skin anyway. Like, I got eczema. So, which is... AKA dermatitis, extremely dry skin. There you go. Um, so I, when I lotion up, I lotion up a lot. Like, I lotion up that, like, when I get out the shower, but I'll be good, and I'll be good after that. But I put a lot of lotion on because my skin be hella dry. Like, so I'm trying to see what this, uh, foot cream be like. And, yep, so <clears throat> I will do a review on it. And let you guys, um, see me trying it and let you guys see, you know, give you guys my honest opinion. Um, yeah, so that's another video. Um, I probably won't film that video today. I'll probably film it, what's tomorrow, Sunday? Probably tomorrow, and then I'll put it out for, um... Either tomorrow night or Monday night. Because I do like schedule uploads. Anyway, that's neither, neither here nor there. Alright, so that's going to be the end of today's video. If you like today's video, go ahead and hit that thumbs up button. And hit me down in the comments for some suggestions. Uh, let me know how you like today's video. And I hope you stay peaceful. I hope you stay breezy. Fo-cheesy. And I love you. Bye.